How you doing? My name is Dr. Sami Bayer. Please welcome back to my YouTube channel. Why many narcissists practice witchcraft and black magic? The narcissist, the black magician, the witch. Now, the idea that many narcissists practice witchcraft or ma black magic might, might be rooted in stereotypes or misconceptions rather than fact. But one thing is clear, narcissists are master manipulators. They will do anything to manipulate their victims, including practicing witchcraft and black magic. So in this video, I'm going to explain why many narcissists could practice witchcraft or black magic. Being master, masters of manipulation, Narcissists desire control. Their aim is to control you, to manipulate you. They need power. So their desire for control and power is one reason why they practice witchcraft and, and black magic. They seek control and power over others. And we know that some forms of witchcraft or black magic can be associated with these themes of control and power. So, narcissists could easily be drawn to practices that promise to enhance their influence or manipulate situations to their advantage. The other reason why many narcissists practice witchcraft or black magic is because of their self-importance. Narcissists may be attracted to occult practices if they feel it reinforces their sense of specialness or uniqueness. Engaging in practices that are seen as mysterious or esoteric can feed into their self-image of being exceptional or above ordinary people. Remember, narcissists think they are special than others. They are more important than everyone else. Narcissists also enjoy attention and drama. And they enjoy this attention and drama that can come with unusual or controversial practices. This dramatic flair and the potential for intrigue in witchcraft or black magic might appeal to the narcissist's desire for validation and recognition. The other reason why many narcissists practice witchcraft and black magic is because of emotional regulation. Engaging in witchcraft might offer some narcissists a way to manage their emotions or deal with their internal struggles. Rituals and spells can provide a sense of structure or control in their lives, even if it's through symbolic means. Remember, narcissists are often driven by a need for control and dominance, and witchcraft and black magic can offer a sense of power and influence of others, which aligns with narcissistic individuals' desire to manipulate the environment and people around them. So by practicing rituals that claim to alter reality or influence others' behavior, narcissists can fulfill their need for control in ways that conventional methods might not. Witchcraft again can be appealing to narcissists because it can provide them with a sense of specialness and uniqueness. By engaging in these occult practices, they might feel they possess exclusive knowledge or powers, reinforcing their inflated sense of self-importance. This external validation can be particularly enticing for someone who is a narcissist. Narcissists may use witchcraft to exert influence of others. This can include casting spells or performing rituals aimed at manipulating people's feelings, decisions, or behaviors. For instance, they might use love spells to attract someone into their orbit or binding spells to prevent someone from leaving them. Narcissists are dramatic people and they are secretive people. And uh, with this, the drama, the secrets associated with this black magic all aligns with narcissistic tendency to seek attention and create drama. So when narcissists engage in occult practices, it can generate a sense of mystery and allure which can be used to captivate and manipulate others. So this ongoing drama can feed the narcissist's need for recognition and excitement. Narcissists also use black magic or witchcraft as a means of revenge or punishment against those who have wronged them. They might perform curses or hexes to cause harm or discomfort to perceived enemies. So, 
They use witchcraft to punish the enemies. This use of magic aligns with their vengeful tendencies and desire to assert dominance over those who have slighted them. Again, narcissists use witchcraft and black magic to exploit vulnerability by positioning themselves as practitioners of witchcraft or black magic. Narcissists can exploit others' fears and vulnerabilities. They might use their supposed mystical powers to create dependency or fear, making individuals more susceptible to their influence. This exploitation can enhance their control over others. Witchcraft and black magic often involves rituals and symbols that are esoteric and difficult for outsiders to understand. Narcissists can use this complexity to manipulate perceptions presenting themselves as powerful or enlightened figures. This can reinforce their grandiose self-image and make it harder for others to question the authority. Some narcissists might be drawn to witchcraft as a form of rebellion against established norms and authorities. By adopting occult practices, they can challenge conventional structures and norms, presenting themselves as defiant and unconventional. This rebellion can be a way to assert their superiority and individuality. Now, the charismatic allure of witchcraft can help narcissists build a following by positioning themselves as leaders or gurus in occult practices. They can attract admirers who are eager to learn from them. Now, this ability to create and control a group of followers satisfies their need for admiration and adoration. So, engaging in witchcraft, again, can allow narcissists to reinforce their sense of superiority. They may view themselves as having special hidden knowledge or abilities that set them apart from others. This sense of being uniquely gifted or enlightened can bolster the already inflated self-esteem. Witchcraft can offer an escape from reality, which might be appealing to narcissists who find it difficult to face their personal flaws or shortcomings. The fantastical elements of magic can provide a way to avoid dealing with real-life issues and maintain their idealized self-image. The mystic associated with witchcraft can enhance a narcissist charisma. By presenting themselves as enigmatic or magical figures, they can attract and captivate others, further feeding their need for admiration and validation. The allure of the unknown can amplify their personal charm. Narcissists might use magic to manipulate personal relationships, seeking to control the feelings or actions of partners, friends, or family members. Techniques such as love spells or binding spells can be employed to make individuals more compliant or emotionally dependent. Narcissists may exploit superstitions and fears related to witchcraft to their advantage. By invoking fears of curses or supernatural retribution, they can manipulate others into compliance or, or silence. This exploitation of fear can be a powerful tool in their arsenal of control. Witchcraft can be used to craft and project a specific persona. Narcissists might adopt the image of a mystical or powerful being to align with their desired self-image. This crafted persona can help them achieve their goals of admiration and influence. The mysterious nature of witchcraft can help sustain interest and engagement from those around the narcissist. By continually presenting new rituals or practices, they can keep their audience intrigued and independent, maintaining their status as a central figure in their social circle. Rituals and ceremonies associated with witchcraft can provide a narcissist with dramatic scenarios to participate in or create. This drama can be used to draw attention to themselves, engage others, and maintain a sense of excitement and importance. Narcissists might use witchcraft to claim spiritual superiority or enlightenment by presenting themselves as processors or as possessors of secret or advanced spiritual knowledge. They can further their sense of being above others, enhancing their grandiose self-image. The use of black magic and occult practices can create an aura of mystery, of mystery and intrigue around a narcissist. This aura can make them appear more fascinating and desirable, feeding their need for admiration and keeping others engaged in their personal narrative. The use of occult symbols and language can serve as a tool for manipulation. Narcissists use these symbols to create an atmosphere of fear, of respect, 
which can help them maintain control over others and reinforce their position of authority within their social or personal circles. In summary, the attraction of some narcissist witchcraft and black magic often stems from their underlying psychological need for control, validation, and influence. The practice associated with these occult fields can offer various avenues for a narcissist to achieve their goals, whether through direct manipulation, creating drama, or reinforcing their sense of superiority. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you've not done so.